It's really exciting today to announce a major milestone for Artemis Technologies, moving into our new facility here in Belfast Harbour, right in the heart of the Titanic Quarter, next to a number of our consortium partners, Spirit Aero Systems, Catalyst, Queen's University, Belfast, Belfast Met College. It's just fantastic to be here right in the hub of the city. Queen's Island facility is going to allow us to turn our prototyping activities into a production chain for the first Artemis e foiler propulsion system. And so over the next year or so, we'll uh, very likely double our workforce to support these activities. This facility is just over 42,000 square feet in size. In the future, it's going to be housing our design and engineering team. Um, it's going to be a manufacturing place for developing and assembling a number of the components for our e-foiler systems. We have two vessels currently in Queen's Island. One is our, what we call internally the TMV-1 project, which is the first Artemis e-foiler vessel. Next to it is a sister ship, where we call the support vessel. The idea there is to benchmark our new propulsion system versus a conventional support vessel using conventional outboard engines. Over the coming weeks, we're going to be installing on-water solutions so that we can launch and test our vessels right here from Belfast Harbour. Initially, that will be the 11 meter workboat that you can see behind me, and then moving on to the high-speed passenger ferries and crew transfer vessels, the offshore wind sector that we're currently developing.